of the cutest cleansers I've ever seen before. So this is the Melody Susie's Cat Paw Cleanser and all you have to do is charge it and you can switch on this like vibrator thing and it'll help you clean your face. So I just put some cleanser on and I'm just massaging it into my face and I put some water and I just rinsed it off. You can even like wash this so it's reusable. Plus there's even a heating option so you can like actually massage your face with some lotion and put this heating option. And Heat makes your face super relaxed and it has a cute holder. Five Amazon beauty finds. First up are these velvet beauty sponges that are similar to the beauty blender but they are less spongy and more of a microfiber material and they blend in your makeup really well. Next is the self tanning cream that gives you a nice bronze color over time as it develops. I love that it doesn't smell like a normal tanning lotion, it actually smells really good and the branding is super pretty. This face toner to use after you cleanse, it helps your skin to be really soft and smooth and even your skin tone. Next is a set of blemish extractors. It has five tools in the set, all of which are different sizes depending on what you need it for. And lastly is this moisturizer and primer in one. And I also just really wanted to share the packaging just because I thought it was really cool and unique. But it's called Moonshine. And like I said, it's a primer and moisturizer. So it helps to prime your face for your makeup and then also moisturize it as well. It's definitely more of a thick and creamy consistency rather than thin, but I've really been liking it. Amazon finds that just make sense. These hair oil capsules smell amazing and make my hair really soft. The set of four clear makeup bags are so convenient to travel with. These mint lip masks are so cute and extra, but they are nice. And I love this pink vintage mirror tray. This Catch Beauty mask is an absolute must have. It's a pink clay mask and it's moisturizing, brightening, and it's just so good. It's super creamy and it's super easy to apply so all you do is just use this spatula that comes with it and you just put it on your face and then wait for 15 minutes it helps me get rid of my pimples and clears up my skin immediately my skin looks so good after using it i just love it it's one of my faves Guys, this is the coolest thing ever. So this is what it looks like, and it's supposed to turn any cleanser into foam. So to start off, you're supposed to put one pearl size drop of cleanser inside. I don't know if you can tell, but I think that's a pearl size. And then just has to fill up to the water. Level. So I got my water in, and now we're just gonna place this in here and just keep pumping. So it's already been like three seconds, and I feel the foam. Okay, I think it's done. Did you guys see this? They completely turned it into like marshmallow foam. <laughs> so I wet my face so I can try this. Oh my god. <laughs> this feels so nice. I think this is definitely a 10 out of 10.
pass on things you didn't know you needed beauty room edition part two first up is this mini fridge which stores my skincare perfectly you can also throw some little snacks in here it's adorable then we have this acrylic organizer which stores my sponges q-tips and cotton rounds it was pretty inexpensive and looks very sleek on my desk I have a million and one brushes and this brush holder was a game changer. It rotates so it makes them very accessible when I'm doing looks. If you do soap brows, trust me, you need this. It's such a messy thing to do, but this keeps it really clean. And lastly is this tissue cover. It's marble and it just helps my desk look more cohesive. All the links are in my bio. 10 amazing beauty finds under $10. This cocoa butter bomb is great for chapped lips or dry skin. This starter makeup brush set. The Billy Razor in travel case. This physician's formula bronzer that smells just like the beach. This set of beauty sponges. These makeup remover towels. All you have to do is add water. This Himalayan salt scrub for exfoliating. This e.l.f. setting spray to mattify your makeup. This setting powder from ColourPop. And lastly, these glow boosting drops that I love to add to my foundation. Five cool beauty products I got on Amazon. This little pore scrubber is great to clear out blackheads and whiteheads. You just rub it around your nose and chin area or wherever you have blackheads. Foliating brush, you can use it on your lips or even on areas where you have whiteheads and blackheads. I like using these two in combination. It's a five color blush stack. This cute little panda refreshes and hydrates the under eye area. This hyaluronic acid serum hydrates your skin without clogging your pores and is really affordable. random Amazon Things Beauty Edition. First up, these are my two favorite face masks. The first one's Matcha Mood, and I love using this little face mask brush to apply it because it's much more sanitary than your hands. And then this one's the Egg White Pore Mask. This one leaves your skin feeling so good. I'm literally obsessed with it. One of my favorite products ever is this teeth whitening pen because I'm so impatient for the strips and it's just really easy. All you do is apply it to your teeth. And to all my girls out there, if you don't shave your face yet, I'd highly recommend. It's a form of exfoliating, but it also gets off all that little peach fuzz and you can do it to your eyebrows and your makeup goes on so flawlessly. My skincare fridge, which I love and it's so cute, keeps your products cold, which feels so much better on your face, but also helps with puffiness. I mean, it might be extra, but it's just really cute in your bathroom. This beauty blender I will hype forever because it's one of those big ones too. I use a different part of it for like powder, contour, whatever it is. It's just amazing. Slide up makeup mirror, 10 out of 10. Perfect makeup lighting, but it also has the magnifying side so you can do your eyebrows. 60 scrunchies for only 8 dollars i promise you'll never run out of scrunchies now my two favorite things for organizing my beauty products are both these little spinny things i don't even know the technical name technical what am i saying but yeah they're really cute did anybody else buy castor oil in hopes of growing their lashes and brows and could never find a good way to apply it? I always tried using q-tips and I globbed the oil on so thick I was not with it until my best friend told me about these that I got off of Amazon. It comes with some funnels, whatever these things are called, stoppers, and then the empty mascara tubes and wands. So let's try it out together. The first thing I did was put in the funnel and started funneling in the castor oil. I feel like one of those lip gloss brands that shows how they make their products and definitely leave a little bit of room at the top so that when you put the wand in it doesn't completely overflow it's crucial to put the stopper on there because this is what is going to really control the amount of castor oil that's going onto your lashes you never want too much because then it can honestly be hard to see and again i got these off of amazon i think they were around seven dollars the link is in my bio let's see if it grows my lashes travel beauty must-haves from amazon First up is this case for your beauty sponge. It's made of silicone, so it's really flexible and can fit anywhere in your bag, and it has ventilation at the bottom so your sponge doesn't get moldy or smelly. Next up is this organizer so you can easily travel with your vitamins or supplements. It's super sleek and well-made and won't make you look like you're 90. Last up is this travel perfume bottle. You can fill it up directly from your full-size bottle of perfume, and it makes it really easy to travel with your favorite scent. My favorite Amazon beauty finds. These face shavers. They're perfect for removing any peach fuzz and dead skin. They also make your makeup glide on so much smoother. A dupe of the Foreo. It has loads of different settings and it is under £10. Olaplex number no. 3. This is the best hair mask for damaged hair. It will bring all your split ends back to life. Next is castor oil. I pop this on my lashes and eyebrows before I go to bed. It helps to strengthen and lengthen your lashes and brows. I have seen huge results in just two weeks. This wet skin moisturizer. You pop this on when you're just about to get out of the shower and then pat yourself dry. This helps to lock in the moisture and keep your skin nice and hydrated for the rest of the day. And a silk scrunchie. 
I absolutely love this brush set. It's super cute and it has 12 brushes. It's really good quality and it feels like feathers on your skin. It includes the names on the bottom. They're super good in blending out your eyeshadow and it fits into your bag perfectly. Amazon Skincare Favorites Part 3 This vitamin C serum is great for hydrating and brightening your skin. It has helped fade my hyperpigmentation so much. I love this hydrating eye stick for my puffy eyes and the packaging is adorable too. This rose hip oil. I love this eye balm because it leaves a really beautiful glow under your eyes. And lastly, this 2-in-1 lip mask and lip scrub. Back at it with another Amazon find. Came in a set of four and they are all of these drawers. I'm gonna use them to store some of my lip products on my desk. I'm gonna organize them by brand. And here's what it ended up looking like. Six skincare must-haves from Amazon. First is Bio Oil. It's great for scars, stretch marks, any sort of uneven skin tone. I use it on both my face for old acne scars as well as stretch marks. Next up is this Indian Healing Clay, and I literally swear by this product. If you have acne-prone skin, this is for you. It's even helped my cystic acne. You mix the clay with water or apple cider vinegar to create a mask. It really helps to deep clean your pores, and it has helped my skin dramatically. My favorite makeup primer is the Tula Skincare Brighten Up Smoothing Primer Gel. I love that it's silicone-free, and it really helps to smooth out your skin before you apply makeup. It's also loaded with probiotics, which are great for your skin. Whenever I apply a face mask, I always use these brushes. They help you to evenly apply product, and they're super easy to clean, so they're very sanitary. This scar cream has been a miracle worker. I've used it on different scars throughout my body and even on my acne scars too. If you're looking to add a retinol to your skincare routine, I love this one, and I especially love the price tag. It has helped the overall texture of my skin tremendously.